Hi, it's Graham Mahal here from Fine and Country Coventry. I hope you're all keeping well and safe. Of course, here with your property market update for July 2021. And just some amazing news that, again, I was going through while having a look about um, the UK update, and you know we then go on to a bit more of a micro view, if that's okay with yourselves, onto Coventry and the surrounding areas. But it's been a 13.4% annual price in increase in June. That's 13.4% annual price increase in June, the highest level since November 2004. In England, of course, on the 1st of July, stamp duty, of course, is now the threshold is at 250,000. Um, and on top of that, Supla says it's been the fastest market they've seen in five years. And I thought just one other little fact that I wanted to kind of hopefully share with yourselves as well, which I thought was quite interesting uh, as well, is the um, the increase of sales above the 500 level um, is up by 49% higher than in May 2019. So the number of sales that were agreed above 500,000 is up by 49% in comparison to May 2019. And what I'd like to do is, like I say, give you a little bit of an overview of what's been going on. And we've had some, some really great results. And when I talk about great results, it's about the results that we've achieved um, for our clients and our customers. I have a fantastic property, another property on in Berks, well, already completed on one, which of course is Priory Orchard that we sold via um, social media. But we had another property on Wadbound, not too far from Berryfield Farm. Again, able to allow that family to move on with their life via my colleague John over at London Spa. But more important, the family that are going to be buying that property are absolutely over the moon that they can uh, take on that home, make that house their home, but not only for themselves, but also for the children. So really, really great results. And then if we swing just over to Addison, another sale that was agreed, and that one at Wad Barn was at 1.4 million, and we achieved an offer over the asking price due to the amount of interest that we had on that property. Had another property, as you probably remember in Riverview, an absolutely stunning home. The one with the wine cellar that opened up in the centre, overlooking the lake at the back. Well, we had an incredible open house there, in excess of double figures viewings there. And that property sold for the full asking price, which is really great news. It allows my client there to be able to move on with his life. But more importantly, it allows a family to move into that house and really turn that house into a home again. So it's just great news for everyone. And some really exciting times coming up. We've got some really great properties coming on. Another one in Bulkington for a million pounds. Uh, another property coming on in Gibbet or Gibbet Hill, depending how you pronounce it, in Poppyfield Court. Already open house this Saturday. I think the open house is a couple of slots available, but already getting fully booked up. Uh, we've got another property in El Shilton. Great bungalow and a great um, plot size again. And we've got the Manor House coming up in Austria, which also offers paddocks and potentially a bungalow to that as well. Uh, we've got a couple more properties also coming up. There's another one in Frelongley, the old butcher's house. Beautiful home situated in the heart of the village, moments from the village church, moments from the outstanding village school there as well. And I know we've also got a couple of fresh pops going to be coming up throughout the month of August, which we'll be coming into very, very shortly. But if you're thinking about potentially buying or moving in the upper cool town market, please do not hesitate to reach out to myself or my business partner, Nick Bartlett. As always, thanks ever so much for staying tuned. Keep well, keep kind, keep safe.